fishing on Lake Managua. For many locals, it's still their only source of income. The fishermen here are glad the lake isn't so polluted now. This fisherman says that things have improved and the fish are healthier now. This sewage treatment plant has made the difference. For decades, human waste from over a million people flowed straight into the lake. But that changed in 2009. During a tour through the treatment plant, the operator explains that more than 90% of the solid matter is filtered out here. This still doesn't make the water safe to drink, but it's much cleaner than before. The project cost some 25 million euros. Funding was organized by German development bank KFW and provided by the German Ministry for Economic Cooperation and Development. A new idea should cut operating costs. The sewage sludge is aerated and left to dry until it forms a granulate, producing a new all-natural fertilizer. The first customer is Ricardo Coronel Kautz, a dairy farmer who used to work for the Agriculture Ministry. He uses the granulate to fertilize his pasture. He used to use around 30 tons of chemical fertilizer. So he saves money and so does the sewage treatment plant, which no longer has to dispose of the sludge. And as synthetic fertilizers are made from fossil fuels, the environment also profits. Project developer Helge Jan explains. The more people use waste products to replace synthetic fertilizers, the more they contribute to the reduction of CO2 emissions. Granada on Lake Nicaragua faces similar problems. Located some 50 kilometers southeast of Managua, Granada is Nicaragua's top tourist destination. Yet three quarters of the households here aren't connected to the sewer system. The city's drinking water is already contaminated and if nothing is done, people could become ill. There are plans to improve water quality and overhaul the old sewage treatment plant. Now even water that's been treated is still full of residue from detergents and algae. Lake Nicaragua is the largest drinking water reservoir in Central America. More than 17 million euros are to be invested to keep it clean.